David Lange has stepped down as Prime Minister. He told a news conference just before noon that he would tender his resignation to the Governor-General tomorrow morning. Mr Lange didn't give detailed reasons for his decision, but said he was influenced by medical advice. His shock announcement comes hard on the heels of the Labour caucus decision to put former Finance Minister Roger Douglas back into Cabinet. And the deep divisions over that issue have taken their toll. I have to say to you that the government has come an extraordinarily long way in five years. If you examine what has happened in the last few months, there has been from time to time what amounted to an extremely uh, difficult, uh, personally denigrating destabilisation campaign of some significant proportion. I was delighted to be able to put that behind me when the government drafted its budget for this year. <coughs> that budget put an end to what had seen hitherto to be some relentless juggernaut of the new right. It's clear few in the Labour caucus knew what was coming this morning, but party president Ruth Dyson says she knew Mr Longy had thought of quitting some time ago. Ms Dyson says although she tried to talk Mr Longy out of resigning, she's still shocked and dismayed by today's events. Reaction from across the Tasman has just come through. Australian Prime Minister Bob Hawke says he regards David Longy as a good personal friend and a good friend to Australia, despite major policy differences over the ANZUS issue. We'll have the latest developments in another update at five minutes past four, with full reports in the Network News at six and the Homes program. Eyewitness News will be on air early tonight at nine o'clock with a special one-hour program. Good afternoon. Increasing understanding, promoting harmony and shared relaxation. The Art of Massage is next on One. Don't make jokes with bankers, Mr Wayne. He's ambitious, ruthless, a man who beat the system. I'm the country's leading authority on illegal procedures. He stalks computer thieves. You said it was one of the computer thieves? It will be. They like to work in dark corners under stone. The man who's called in to check the man who rules the computer. That's who rules the world. The Consultant, this Wednesday, 8.30 on Television One.